Hello Beach Bums, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. There's a question that I get all the time and it is a legitimate question because I used to do this and I posted several videos doing this and that's if I run beach fishing guided trips. I don't anymore, I used to. I did it for several years. It's something I haven't done in a long time and I made a couple of videos talking about it but if you didn't see those videos, you wouldn't have noticed. But I've got some really good news. Pepsi is actually sponsoring a summer giveaway it's going to include a fishing trip with yours truly. Also, you're going to get concert tickets to go see Keith Urban. There's a lot going on. It's a really cool opportunity. It's free. You just got to sign up for a chance to win. And I really want one of you guys to win this thing. Of course, it's open to the public. Anybody can enter. But I want to meet you guys. So I need you to go sign up for it. Two things. I need you to go sign up for it. And I need you to finish watching this video. <laughs> so that's your homework from me today. But this is a big giveaway. It's free. Just sign up. I've got a link in the description below. So make sure you go do that at some point today. But also don't forget to finish this video as well. Because I'm doing one of my most favorite things. And if you follow the channel, you know that throwing big lures, topwater poppers, jerk baits, big spoons, whatever, for Jack Revelle, big redfish, bluefish, trout, all that stuff. It's my favorite thing to do. And we have entered the season where that is like a huge opportunity in the surf. So tomorrow, I'm getting my stuff ready, getting geared up for it. Tomorrow is gonna be my first session of the season where I'm going out and throwing big lures for big fish. Let's go. Okay, this is my first time on the beach in almost two weeks uh, because I, I had the virus, which knocked me out of fishing for a little over a week and also, the grass i was avoiding coming out here uh, for a few fishing trips just because the grass was so bad we have a north wind today looking in the water there is still grass up close and i can see it in the breaking waves a little but it does not look terrible i i think we might have some fishable conditions this is my first cast of the morning I don't feel like I got any grass on here. That's good news. I can work a topwater popper, bring it back in grass free so far. Yeah, Fred this morning, he's eyeballing some bait that's jumping right here, right beside the beach. There might be some trout. There is a giant field, I don't know, like area of bait flipping right here. Huge pot of bait. I don't see any fish working them. We'll throw around it. Seems to be some stuff going on a little further down the beach as well. I don't know if you can see in the GoPro. Maybe not. I know it's always hard to tell. GoPro sucks at long distance. There's a lot of birds. I know you probably can't see the bait. And a lot of what's rolling is the ladyfish. Oh, right there. Something smacked it right by the beach. What do we got? Ladyfish. <laughs> Dang. First fish of the morning. All right, that'd be some great cut bait. Get you back. At least got the skunk out of the way. Switching over to an X wrap. Gonna go subsurface. There's a lot of activity on top, but it's mostly these ladyfish. There's a fish. There's a fish. Ah, oh, lady. Dang it. Oh gosh. Okay. Big fish. On the X wrap. Goodness. There's a boat out there too. Which I'm not excited about that. Because he's running that way. 
Big fish. Smoke the x trap. Just casting, casting, and casting. Okay, here we go. Nice. Why I wanted to come out here. Oh, goodness. I backed down the drag just a little bit because I had it pretty tight, kind of thinking Jack Cravel. So I wanted to uh, back it down in case it was something different. I think we got a nice red fish on here. Nice red. We've been a lot of activity this morning. Not a whole lot on top other than the ladyfish. There we go. <laughs> I love throwing big plugs. I always say this is my favorite way to surf fish. Man, this guy has got some spunk. There we go. There's so much bait around here right now. And this guy took off. Oh, he's got a few spots on a beautiful fish. I just want you to stay hooked, buddy. Just stay hooked. Nice. Nice redfish. Perfect size, like, oh, he looks barely hooked. Can't tell. Wow. Nice. Okay. There we go. Beautiful red. Beautiful red fish. Probably just over slot. Beautiful colors on these beach reds. They are aggressive. This size right here is so spunky. They're so, they've got so much fight in them. He, uh, he took me for a good ride. A lot of spots. Really nice decorations on this fish. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six on that side and just the one on the other but beautiful fish on the x-wrap made the change we'll get them back awesome morning thank you for the fight let me get you back oh there you go so pretty love redfish on the beach Woo! they get you fired up every time oh god Ladyfish on the popper. They hit pretty aggressive. And uh, I think these are the first ladyfish I've caught this year. Woo, there he is. Acrobatic. <laughs> Definitely not the target. But, whoa, that was perfect. I mean, if every ladyfish would do that, I would be. I'd be okay catching them. It's when you have to bring them up and they poop on you and they're trying to throw hooks all over you. That's when uh, ladyfish get frustrated. Making the walk back from the point and I've got an ES lure tied on. It's similar to a diamond jig. You can pick these up at ninjatackle.com. I got a link in the description, but great beach fishing lure. It's heavy, shiny. You can cast it a really long ways. I can't remember what weight this one is. If I had to guess, maybe half, half an ounce, three quarter of an ounce maybe. But a great lure just to fast retrieve on the beach. It, uh, it's, got, it's got good action on it. I do like to tie mine with a loop knot. That gives it the absolute best presentation. Uh, there's something, it's cool, something swimming through the surf. They look big. Oh, got him. Got him. Got something. What the heck? Uh, this is not what I was throwing at. What is that? Oh. <laughs> A blue runner. 
Okay, I, I saw something a lot bigger. Maybe it was just a school of these guys all clumped together. Well, it's another species. <laughs> Not a ladyfish, little blue runner. Well, it was a little bit slower out there today than I wanted it. I would have loved to have seen some Jack Crevel. It's still early before they get real fired up in the surf. So I've got all summer. Hopefully I will uh, get plenty of swings at the plate at those guys. But didn't see them. A lot of ladyfish. Didn't see any Spanish. And didn't get into any bluefish. Got the one nice red, which is, which is a, that's good. That, that's a great start to this season and this session of throwing these big lures. Not going to complain at all about it. Of course, caught some daggum ladyfish. But, yeah, I think today was my first day catching ladyfish. So usually it, it takes a little while before I'm fed up with them. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Really appreciate it. And as always, you stay bummy.